Hello, Nickel here again. So, uh, today is the first real episode, I guess, of Diary of a Geeky Girl. And I do have some tips that I acquired. My friend Kara, who is away at college right now, uh, she provided some very good tips on the skincare products that I had showed you uh, last episode. Um, and most of the stuff I'm just going to be reading right from the screen, so pardon that I won't be looking directly at the camera most of the time. Um, so her tips about the the apricot scrub, uh, the one where uh, I got CVS's brand, but you can also use St. Ives. Uh, anyways, she says, Using a daily facial scrub can be great if it is gentle. Using a daily scrub is unnecessary if you use a chemical exfoliant like alpha or beta hydroxy. The rule is to always be gentle and don't overdo it. You need to be nice to your skin or it will get irritated. If it starts to irritate the skin, bottom line is to stop using it. And then on the face wash that I have in Olay brand, absolutely you can use it every day. Again, depending on how your skin reacts with the product and if it's gentle. Use before makeup to clean the skin and prepare the skin for moisturizer. And for moisturizer, specifically about the CVS one that I had, the one with aloe, Here's where your skin may act differently with the moisturizer. Because you, me, have dry and oily skin, the best kind of moisturizer to find is one that suits both of these problems, which can be difficult to find. Just watch your skin when using the moisturizer because your skin may not like it in some areas like the oily parts, but other areas like the drier areas may not mind it. A good moisturizer should go on without feeling greasy. A quality moisturizer should never irritate or burn the skin. Since I do have a tight budget, I'd wait to invest in a smarter moisturizer because this is where you may have the most issues with your skin. Just something to think about. And then specifically about the Avon one. Um, she said that she hasn't used that one, but her mom is an Avon representative and she's used a lot of their products. Again, depends on how your skin reacts. Some of their stuff my friend Kara has used, uh, but most of them she stopped using because she found something better to replace it. So thank you very much, Kara, for all those tips and good things to think about. Um, also, talking about the Avon moisturizer, I did use it last night, and it I didn't use very much of it. I just used little dabs here and there, and it, it made my skin all over feel very greasy, and when it was drying, it didn't kind of dry like like the CVS moisturizer did. It made my skin feel like tacky to the touch. It was really weird and I didn't like it. And my skin was still really greasy in the morning when I, well, <laughs> afternoon when I woke up. I have really weird sleeping habits. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to get out of that. But anyways, um, so I think I'm just gonna stick with the CVS brand because the, yeah, that Avon one just made my skin feel really weird. I mean, it didn't like burn or anything, but still, yeah. Um, I like the CVS one. It smells nice too. <laughs> Anyways, uh, so today I went out job hunting. Uh, I'm kind of nice for it, right? Oh, and I'm actually wearing makeup, unlike the last video. I used some tips that, uh, hopefully you can see, I don't know if you could. Um, I used some tips from the tutorials that I watched, especially from Michelle Fenn, who I linked to in the last one. Um, and uh, I think it looked alright. I mean, I, I fail pretty hard with eyeliner anyway, so it doesn't look the greatest. But uh, I'm really happy with my eyeshadow. So yes, went out job hunting today. I filled out a lot of applications. I still have a few more to fill out. <laughs> um, and I've got to do some online ones as well, so hopefully I can get a job. So that's all about that. And then I decided that on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays I'm going to do 20 minutes of some sort of aerobic exercise or cardio workout, something like that. Um, most of the time I'm probably just going to be rehearsing the Japanese pop dances that I've been learning. I've been really slacking off on them though. Um, so yeah, like I said, I'll probably mostly do that, but today with all the walking around for the applications and you know, visiting all the stores and stuff. Um, yeah, I got my workout from the walking, definitely. Oh, and I just handed in a little notebook. I am writing down what, every time I do my skincare stuff, the the scrub and the face wash and the moisturizer. Um, 
I'm also writing down when I wear makeup, too. Um, just so that I can keep track of what I'm doing, because a lot of time it's like, huh, when was the last time I did this? You know, I really don't remember. So, because I have a really bad memory, so writing stuff down, I figured that would be good. And I don't know why I keep doing this. It's annoying. I'm sorry. Anyways, so... Well, just to prove how geeky I am, since this is Diary of a Geeky Girl, a bunch of my friends came up tonight, and we randomly decided to play a few rounds of poker. Uh, we started off with, was it, five card draw. Mind you, I, I know very little about poker, I learned a lot tonight. We started off with five card draw, and then we moved to Texas Hold'em. I like Texas Hold'em a lot better. And instead of using chips, we used Pokemon energy cards from the card game. <laughs> Was it? The grasses were one worth one dollar, fightings were five, fire was ten, water was twenty-five, electric was fifty, and psychic was one hundred. I think I think I covered them all. Yeah. <laughs> it was crazy. But I ended up winning at the end, so that was cool. They helped me a lot along the way though. But yeah, I, I like the Texas one, that was fun. I've been playing a lot of Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep, but I am addicted to that game. <laughs> um, that's, it's wonderful. I love it. Um, aside from that, I think that's it. Um, I just want to mention that even though I've done videos two days in a row right now, my videos aren't going to be every day. Um, at least probably not. But um, I, I wanted to do one today since I actually got out and did stuff. Um, so, yeah, I think that's it. Thanks for tuning in. Take care. I hope you were able to learn some stuff, and hopefully we'll learn some stuff together. And again, if you have any tips relating to health or beauty, skin care, anything like that, please let me know in the comments below. So, take care, and have fun, and be yourself. Bye!